Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I want to thank Congressman Johnson for his leadership. Mr. Johnson is focused. He is an individual who is bringing this whole body forward, and I look forward to working with him continually on these issues. You know, there's a saying, we all know it, the truth shall set you free. The accusations made against the Bidens more than require an investigation. These accusations have painted a picture of corruption, bribery, and shameful behavior unbecoming of our executive branch. Let's talk about them a little bit. Bank records obtained by the Oversight Committee reveal almost $20 million in payments directed to Biden's associates and family. These aren't Republican talking points. These aren't Jeff Van Drew talking points. This is the reality that we've already found. Over 150 transactions involving the Bidens have been flagged as, quote, suspicious activity. And that's not only by the banks, but also the Treasury Department. President Biden himself participated in phone calls with his son Hunter. It's a fact. Effectively acting as the merchandise that was being sold by his son Hunter, who was a salesman and they close deals, and we want to know what they're about. Calls that led to the funneling of millions of dollars to Hunter and other Biden family members and Hunter's associates. The list goes on and on and on. I'm only touching the surface. This is more, this is more than enough to garner the extra powers granted from an impeachment inquiry. Our goal is to get the, to the truth. As I said in the beginning of this conversation, the truth shall set you free. If there's nothing for them to worry about, they should welcome an impeachment inquiry. They should welcome producing the records. They should be welcoming producing the statements. It's just the truth that we want. Our duty, we have a mission, a duty, and a responsibility. Our duty is to restore the American people's faith in our institutions. Our mission is to reaffirm that no one person, no one group is ever above the law in the United States of America. This inquiry will move forward with full transparency and steadfast resolve. If there's nothing here to hide, there's nothing here to worry about. But if the allegations are confirmed, there will be and needs to be justice. Thank you, and I yield back.